good morning. I am enjoying my coffee with some cream from the top of our raw milk. You let it sit for a while and it just has like two, two inches of cream on the top. And so that's a delicious addition to my coffee. But I've also been trying to get up a little bit earlier and get things going outside get watering done, get my chamomile picked and kale and get my quiet time going and reading my Bible. And that has just been really setting my day off really well. So it's eight o'clock and husband went off to work already. We've had our breakfast, it's cleaned up and we're all dressed. So it's been a really nice morning already. So on the docket today is a little decluttering and I just want to do a little summer decluttering because I've been out thrifting, collecting things, and I just need to get rid of a few things. And then I think there's a garage sale today that we might go to. And it's yeah! <laughs> My oldest loves going to garage sales. So, um, I don't know what else is on the list for yeah! doing today. Being a homemaker, being a mom, and just bringing you along. I had to put a couple more storage containers in the little cottage for under the bed, added my flowers, and got it ready for guests that are coming tonight. So I am gonna do a little decluttering. Nevaeh's gonna help me. I think we're gonna go through a cabinet that has just a few things in it. I have a few DVDs back in this cupboard here that we don't watch and that we can get rid of. So just ones that you can honestly find online that you would not need to even have. So I got rid of four DVDs. The rest are kind of fun to have on hand. And we don't have Netflix or anything. And then I found this frame I forgot I had. So I'm going to put something in there. And then I forgot I had Little Women. So I might start reading that because I don't know. It sounds like something I would enjoy reading. All right, this basket has some baby toys in it. And Nadia is... 13 and a half months, so she probably doesn't need all of these toys. So some of them I'll just tuck downstairs and then the other ones I'll donate or ask a friend if they would like them. So I'm not getting rid of too much, just those three items. This stuff will all go downstairs or into like the baby toy area um, and with some of our other toy stuff that we just won't need till we have another one. I also went through our other toy bin which has a lot of books. And this is second. And this, I'm gonna take a lot more books downstairs because we do play down in the basement quite a bit or when we have Nieces come, they stay down there, so some extra books in there would be nice, too.
Our library has such a cute little courtyard area with some beautiful flowers. Always fun to just walk by here and see what's blooming. All right, so I got a few things at that rummage sale. It was actually a benefit, like, so donate. So I donated extra, but I got this Old Navy vest. Um, I really love that hunter green, but I may sell it. And then I got some material to maybe just even decorate with or put on my canned goods. It's really beautiful. This one doesn't even look used. I love that kind of florally pattern. And then, yep, I got this cream and sugar or creamer and cup i guess okay and then i got these two old old frames they're kind of like beveled out if you can see that um my husband's gonna think i'm weird but they're kind of cute i really like them and then at the book sale it was 50 cents per uh soft cover so i'm gonna see i've never ran, read a uh, joan meldicott book before but i've started reading a little bit more which is good for me i read beverly lewis before they're kind of like amish christian romance novels and then i don't know about this one but i wanted a mystery and i saw mystery on it and so we'll see i mean if i don't read them i don't read them at least that one i'm sure i'll read these two for sure but kind of a fun little little haul and trip we got to take and the girls had so much fun at the library playing in their little play area too i didn't even know they had it so i'm gonna have to head to the library more often with my little girls so the girls and i ended up walking out and eating lunch at my husband's workplace um all his employees really enjoy having the girls come out so it was really fun just a little special treat to go out and eat lunch with them and now they're down for a nap and so I'm gonna do a little kitchen cleanup. I did my deep clean of the kitchen last night. So I kind of rotate what I deep clean throughout the week. So last night was kitchen. Tonight will be bathroom after the girls take their baths. So um, I'll get to that later, but I'm not sure what I'm gonna do right now. I already have lunch or supper in my mind. So I got hamper thawing for goulash with home froze tomatoes from last year that I want to keep using. I've made this recipe for you before, but it's a really good go-to with some garden fresh green beans for the side. But I might work on a video. Um, I will be making my latte in a little bit and enjoying a little treat as well because you got to have those special moments when the silence is happening around you and it's nice and quiet. So we'll see what I end up working on right now. It's just probably a little tidying and then some working on my computer. So I kind of changed my mind on working on my computer right now. And I'm going to declutter um, some jewelry out of here. Now, I used to sell jewelry in college and um, out of college for about seven years. So I do have a lot, and this is actually very minimal. But there's just some broken ones that I don't wear in here. And ones that I just, yeah, I don't need to have anymore. And I have another whole big container like that big by this big just filled that I need to probably go through as well so I'm just gonna again like I said cut my losses and get rid of some here all right just got a little rid of a few of these bracelets just a really fun big ring but I won't wear it and these earrings are broken and this chapstick we don't need so that was a really quick three minute declutter so down in my basement here, I just keep a running box, or boxes I should say, of things I'm getting rid of. So like this throw blanket we've had on our chair, it's time to go because it's just ripped out there. Um, like I got this cute mailbox for free, but I just, I'm not gonna hang it. So I'm getting rid of it. Some things I was gonna sell on Facebook Marketplace that haven't sold in a while. This coat rack I've had for years, I've never even touched it, so Sometimes it's you cut your losses and just call it good. These pillow inserts are ripping out, so time for those to go. And then just start a new box of the stuff I had there. So it's okay to declutter things if it gives you a peace of mind, even if you paid something for it. So I just have to remind myself of that. I got some good decluttering done of just some small little spaces, but it feels good to have some of that stuff out. And some of the things I didn't even know I had, so why not get rid of those, right? I'm gonna make a little um, hummus here with some chickpeas and tahini that I had, and the girls are up, so 
Um, I'm gonna do that because that's good for snacks and we like to eat that with our fresh garden veggies. And then we may go play, I'm not 100% sure yet. And then it will be prepped for supper already. So I started the goulash, I browned the meat, got some onion in there, I just added some mushrooms, salt and pepper, and then I'll add, add some ketchup, some regular mustard, a little Worcestershire, some Italian seasonings, and then I'll add my home canned tomatoes too. There's our goulash, we have some fresh peaches, and some fresh garden green beans. There's always something to do in the garden in the evenings and the mornings when it's warm out. So I just got done watering by hand and now I have a sprinkler on my corn and tomato pepper onion garden over on the other side of our garage. So I just also pruned my rose bushes because I just watched Garden Answers on how to prune those back. So I pruned my climbing rose bush here. Um, still need to clean the bathroom we'll see how far I get on that but I think I'm gonna call it a vlog today hope you enjoyed coming along and maybe I'll even get to read a little bit of one of my new books tonight well talk with you in the next one